Hey, Sneaky Links back today. For a simple reason, we're back with PC Linux OS again. But this is the LXDE version, so I'm not going to spend too much more time on this one because I've already shown you the KDE and the XFCE version. This one came out at the end of January, so that's over a month ago. I've got quite a few to catch up on, as I was not very well quite a while ago, wasn't I? So I've got a big list. But it's just getting around to doing them, and some you might have to check out, and some I might not. So, anyway. As you can see, nice desktop. I've actually changed the desktop background, which looks nicer. PC LXDE, it looks rather nice. I thought, yes, who ever done that one? Very good indeed. So, usual PC Linux OS stuff, okay? Bear in mind, you've got a location manager. The firewall setup is fully done because this is all installed, by the way. It's not a live CD. Trash Network Center, LibreOffice Manager, My Documents, and LX Terminal, okay? On the bottom here, we have our shutdown menu, and it's LXDE, Time, and we have a little network palette. We get a copy pasty clip manager. Two workspaces, maybe we can have more if you so wish to do so. Firefox is your web browser here. LX Terminal on the bottom. Down here we've got Synaptic Package Manager. There is no software center, it is Synaptic, so you should be comfortable with it anyway, so that should be fine. Configure your computer. I ain't going to show you that today because I've shown it every time. And configure your desktop. Okay, so anyway. Oh, and PC Man File Manager as their file manager. So if I go to, excuse me, the menu, we get basic stuff from PC Linux OS. Remember it's RPM based, okay? RPM. RPM, 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 bim, 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 bim. We've got configuration. Now, as it's LXD, stroke open box. We got a lot of stuff in here. Configure your screensaver, all the stuff in there. Restore master boot record. La -de -la -de -la -la. LX monitor settings. Local -la -la -la. LibreOffice. Oh, by the way, I've actually downloaded the LibreOffice from the LibreOffice manager here. Basically, it's just a link to go and download it. So it's quite a large download, by the way, but I'll show you in a momento. Because it actually looks really nice in the LXD here with PC Linux OS. I thought. So yes, anyway. PC Linux OS Live USB Creator. Bear in mind that I've updated the system already. There is no update manager as such, but what I'll do, I'll show you how, to, how we do it. It's basically synaptic at the end of the day. Database has got LibreOffice, of course, we've installed it. LX Task Manager and your net palette. And for terminals, we have the terminal. Okay, lovely. Under editors, just leaf pad, don't get a lot with it. All that 600 of mega download, I think it's nearly 700 actually. You still don't get a lot with it, even though it's LXDE. But you do get bleach bit, as I've shown you before. And we get a graphics with GPIC view, so that's just a basic view. It's basically, as with any other LXDE distribution mainly, you have to go and get what you want yourself and make it your own. Okay, Firefox, as I've said before, it's now updated itself to 10.0.2, so that's rather nice, but I'll open it up in a minute. And here's our full open office suite. Rather nice, it's 3.5. It's one of the latest ones, latest build anyway. So we'll open LibreOffice up. A bunch of decides to do its stuff. There we go. Lovely jubbly, dooby dooby, and off we go. Now, doesn't that look good? Well, I thought we did. Look, all the icons and everything like that. A bit different from the boring ones we normally have, I thought. They're like in Ubuntu and Debian, quite boring, isn't it? So maybe this is because it's a new version or they've just tweaked it for themselves. I just don't know. But I do like the look of it, it's nice and bright. If we go to help, and I'll show you about the promise, it is 3.5.0 release candidate is three or three or three or twelve or twelve. Can't say it's C set the nerf and all that. Yeah. Anyway, yes. I'll get rid of that one. Okay. Anyway, where was I? Oh yes. Showed you that up in the office. So you get all the office stuff in there and base is in there as well. So I don't know if you've noticed sometimes it doesn't actually come with base. Right, software center, have a laugh. Do be clean, doing your GUI stuff and get rid and clean to duplicates of your RPMs. Libre Office Manager, as I said before, just takes you to the download and asks you a few questions and downloads it for you. Install, remove and upgrade your software. Now, if I go to Synaptic, it wants my password. Now basically, you have to upgrade your system like this. Any new packages that come along, you reload and upgrade. And I'll show you exactly what to do in a memento as soon as it starts reloading. Okay, new done, new done, and we're done. So what I'm going to do now is reload that. Down for the reload, for the reload. Remember that song? Okay, anyway, it's going to reload its stuff. So there's any extra bits and bobs that I may need or may not need. And all you basically do every couple of days or however much you want to do it, I mean, don't leave it too long, obviously, too much to download. But you mark all upgrades. Now, there isn't any, okay, because I've done them yesterday. So that's what I'm good, wasn't it? Yes. But this is where you get all your stuff from. So that's nicey, nicey lemon splicing and all that everything is here that you possibly need now pc links os lxd version is very very good just like the xfc and the kde version i will do the full monty version soon oh, but i'll get round to it but i still have to the bottom of the list because that's not really important i will open up the firefox one more time before we go 
just to show you what it's like really here you go go straight to the pc linux osp that's the one we've done the other day yeah super duper mini cooper and all that we'll go to help about firefox and you'll see your version it's 10.0.2 that's what i said wasn't it i think so i can't remember but brings like a sieve well i really like it but i like lxd and xfc anyway okay so it's super of the duper for me but this one i'm going to give 80 percent yeah 80 over 100 sneaky linux out i see you later bye bye